Hey, this is Demon Driver here, and we are going to cover the template portion of the plans. We are going to make templates, cutout templates, with tracing paper for cutting out our rudder, stabilizer, nose section, tail section, wing box, cross section of the bulkhead. But I'm going to show you the rudder, how to make a template for the rudder. Okay? Here we go. I'm putting on the wire. Here is the wide angle lens view. And we are going to. I'm going to show you guys how to do this. Now, I've already put a piece of tracing paper over the, uh, over the rubber. Okay? What you do is you get a piece of tracing paper. like this, and you place it over the plans. Now watch. This is important. Watch what I do. Move rulers, pen. I'm going to make a hand copy of the plants. Now I'm right now drawing in little marks on the on the paper so that when the time comes everything lines up. So Little marks to line everything up. That way, I can place the ruler on the marks, and it's a little bit easier. And this is basically how you hand copy the plans for the temple. This is going to be a cutout template that I'm going to place over foam when I uh, go ahead and uh, start cutting out the rudders at the end the A's in the next day. This is a very important part of the building phase. Without this, without this, you basically got nothing. You don't have a So I'm gonna, I gotta go back in and figure out which, which stencil I use to do this. What the French curve I use. Some people call them French curves, I just call them curve tools. It really doesn't matter what you call it. This is hard, but this is really, you gotta be really meticulous. There we go. Got to follow the line perfectly. You can't deviate. If you deviate, your your stencil, your tracing is going to be off. Now, in straight lines, of course, you can use a ruler. But 
But again, you've got to get it just right. Has to be has to be dead on or it won't work. Has to be dead on. Everything has to be precise, especially when you're sensitive. You are making your phone cutout master. Has to be perfect. Without exception. It's got to be an exact copy of what you did originally. Because if it isn't, it's not going to look right. It's not going to match the plane. So now I'm doing the lower portion here. Okay. Like I said, this has to match perfectly. You gotta, you gotta give it all your attention.
Mr. Kim onto the uh, onto the paper. And you basically, just do that, and you use your thumbs to uh, straighten it out as it goes over. Now, this is what I'm doing on those plans there for the uh, for my friend Chris's A300 plans that he's going to be. He's going to be getting the soon. I'm working on those too. See what I'm doing? Lay that out over the, over the piece. Like so. Just like that. And now, it's going to protect this piece, this stencil. That I'm going to use to cut out the uh, the rudder for the MDA. So you got to get this right. This doesn't. If this isn't done right, it's not going to work. So we go over run a little bit right there. That's satisfactory. Uh, okay. Razor. Get a razor. Get a razor. Now I can place this over foam now. This is what I can place over foam in order to cut the tail out. This is how I do this. Do you see? I place this over the foam razor and cut it out. That's going to be the next part of the build. Okay? And that's how you do it. That's how you make a stencil. That's all there is to it, folks. Okay, well this is Demon Driver with more MD80 build action coming up. Take care guys. Bye bye.